Thank you. Um, please welcome Sophie Chaudhary. She has joined us. Thank you. Uh, my apologies. I've actually flown in from a completely different place to everybody else. I've been flying through the night, so sorry to be late, but very happy and honored to be here uh, for Shuta Dalvidala in my favorite city, Dubai. So, thank you. Likewise, thank you. Uh, Tushar, welcome to Dubai. Um, thank please, you. Please tell us about your role. Can we expect some comedy? Because uh, when we when we see your name in the movie, in any banner, we expect some amazing comedy coming out from the character. Or is it totally different from what you usually do? Uh, it's not a comic character, what you're, it's like what you're saying. But uh, yeah, there is humor uh, attached to this character. It's it's a Muslim character called Sheikh Muni, who's a hardcore criminal from childhood, and. Uh, he says also when he's introducing himself ki 11 saal ka tha jab pehli chori ki aur 13 saal ka tha jab pehli baar jail gaya so he's very acclimatized to the jail atmosphere uh, having had this experience sheikh munir meets banya sube played by john in jail and uh, inspires him to leave leave sharafat only to the quran sharif and uh, adopt crime as his main profession so that अपने प्रॉब्लम्स को हम सॉल्व कर सके दस वर्ड इन टेल्स इन टेल्स इन की अगर तू मारेगा नहीं तो तू मरेगा या तो तू मार या फिर मर एंड दे गोज दे बिगिन अ जर्नी बिटवीन शेख मोनी एंड मनिया सुरे एज गैंग मेंबर्स एंड दे ट्राई टू बिकम गैंग मेंबर्स क्या होता है उनके साथ उसके बाद सो शेख मुनीर इज बेसिकली लॉर्ड ऑफ थिंग्स इज फनी ही इज एक्सपीरियंस इन द वर्ल्ड ऑफ क्राइम इज अग्रेसिव ही हैज अ मेथड टू इज मैडनेस ही नोज वेन टू कंट्रोल इज एंगर ही नोज वेन टू जब लोहा गर्म है तो हथौड़ा मारना भी आता है उसे एंड वेरी इमोशनल लॉयल फ्रेंड सो यू विल सी सम ऑफ दैट व्हाट यू एक्सपेक्टिंग बट नॉट रियली ओके थैंक यू अब वी हैव सनी लियोनी एज वेल वेलकम टू दुबई एंड वेलकम टू द प्रेस कॉन्फ्रेंस ऑफ शूट आउट एट बडाना वी हैव ऑल सीन यू ऑलरेडी डूइंग द डूइंग द सॉन्ग एंड दिस इज योर फर्स्ट कैमियो इन इन बॉलीवुड सो हाउ डू यू फील अबाउट इट Well, obviously, it feels absolutely amazing. Um, when Balaji called me and asked me to do the song, obviously I said yes. And uh, to put a cherry on my Sunday, they said uh, that they wanted to wanted me to actually have a very small part, but a, a part in the film as well. And um, what was the first feeling when you were approached by Balaji? Well, first they said we want you to do a song, and then obviously, obviously said yes, and then they said no, and then they said yes, and then they said no. Um, And I was on the sets of uh, Rock Me My Mess 2, and uh, the CEO Tanuj called me and said, "We do want you to do this song." And obviously, I said yes again. <laughs> and I uh, played it really cool. And of course, I'll do it without any questions. I didn't know if I had any dates available. I didn't know what was going on. I had no other questions or answers except for yes, I'll be there. You just we'll work it out. Got off the phone, started jumping on the couch. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> um, so it's really, really exciting to get to do this. And the song already has been uh, a bit controversial. We have different version airing on TV. So, uh, what kind of version? What version do we expect in the movie of Lena? Because of the lyrics. Well, obviously we have to respect censor boards and censor laws. So that's all dependent on the country that um, the song is playing in, I believe. So hopefully you get to see the whole song. I believe it's about four and a half minutes. What you're seeing on YouTube and all the other channels is it's a small version of what uh, the actual video looks like. Maybe we'll get to see it today. Perfect. Thank you, Sophie. Um, you've been a regular in Dubai. Um, you're coming straight down from Goa, as you? I am. Yeah. Uh, interesting flight. Goa, Doha, Doha, Dubai. A very convoluted, uh, convoluted route, but. Wanted to be here at any cost because it's such a huge project and it's such an honor to be part of it. Um, so yeah. And um, how do you feel working with um, Tushar, Anil Kapoor, Manoj Bajpayee, John Abram? How's how's been the experience? Well, you know, actually, I uh, in this song got to work mostly with John, yeah. which was really exciting because. Um, Uh, I know everybody's saying that there are three item songs in the movie, but actually, Ala Reala is the anthem of the movie, yeah. and is the anthem of Manya Surve. So it was a wonderful experience to be part of it. Um, Sanjay Gupta uh, called me to meet him, and the first thing he said to me is, "I've seen your new video, Hangama, and I want you to do Ala Reala." And that's really what it was. He said, "Sophie Chaudhary is Broadway. Let's make her janta." 
And I love that because I have, I mean, coming from London and I think that whole image and, you know, MTV DJ and pop diva, it's, it's quite a westernized image, um, which I love, um, you know, and I love that, but it was really nice to be able to do something messy. Um, I didn't get to shake a leg with Anil Ji and we've had this conversation, so that in the next you owe me a dance. Anil, what do you have to say about that? Desperate to dance. Yeah. <laughs> Desperate. No, because, you, know, you cross that age. You know, so they don't want you to dance. They want to give it to all these. No, no. Next, in the next part, for sure. <laughs> Hopefully, next film. Okay. That's a promise. Okay, Sophie, um, the, the song was actually uh, was supposed to be uh, Kamna and you together. And now it's just you and John. So, how do you feel about that? Is there is there a controversy or... Listen, I mean, I think uh, at the end of the day, Kangana is the heroine of the film. She's yeah. done a fabulous job, I'm sure. She's a brilliant actor. And uh, these kind of decisions, we leave to the makers of the film. They do what's right for them and what they think will work. And, uh, you know, let me... Uh, not beat around the bush. I'm thrilled it's become my song. Um, and Fantastic. I'm thrilled it's, uh, it's on us. And I'm really, really thrilled with the response. And response at Machara, so it feels like we've done a good job. And, uh, you know, each to their own, I think. Perfect. Thank you so much. Okay, now we're going to open the question answer session with the press. Um, if you have a question, please raise your hand. We shall give you the mic. We have Bindu here. John, just in case you want to know. Bindu from MS 24-7. Thank you. Hi guys, well, welcome to Dubai. Can you hear me? Sort of. <laughs> Should I just speak out loud? Would that be easier? Right. Um, um, considering part of, at least part of the film is based on the book uh, from Dongri to Dubai, could you just tell us, in all of you actually, that in your research, did any of you actually read the book and read, learn more about the characters you're playing? Uh, I read the book, and uh, we, know, we knew exactly what we were doing. All of us. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure we knew that, uh, but do you want to get into the skin of the character? Was there a lot which was actually explained in the book? Um, I guess uh, once you see the film, you, your comments and your reviews uh, speak more than what we say right now. So, uh, what I'd like to say is that uh, sure. we followed uh, what Sanjay Gupta said. We read the book, sure. and uh, we're very excited about portraying our character. 